Let's understand the concept of functional decomposition with an example which is very important for the design of complex objects. So let's understand this with an example of a bicycle. So functional decomposition is the resolving of functional relationships into their constituent subfunctions, which can then be built together into the whole product. So if you take the bicycle as an example, the bicycle has several subfunctions. So the primary function is to transport a passenger from point A to point B. This function can be then subdivided into subfunctions. For example, the drive mechanism to produce the power is one function. Brake mechanism to stop is another function. A mechanism to steer the bicycle is another function, sub-function. And finally, the structural support of the bicycle to support the weight of the person is another sub-function of the bicycle. So as you can see, the functional decomposition basically breaks down the overall uh, primary function into its elements and then those elements are worked on and concepts are generated for those elements and then those are again integrated into the whole product. This decomposition of function is necessary because you cannot solve the problems as a whole. You have to break down the problem into its constituent elements and tackle those smaller elements to solve the bigger problem. In complex systems which are much more complex than a bicycle, we can also have problems which are divided into sub-problems and those sub-problems are also sub-divided into their own sub-elements. For example, in the design of a car, the functional element of a car would be one would be the engine which is the driving mechanism. The other would be the suspension which is providing the uh, comfort or the vibration damping mechanism. Another would be the braking system which is providing the stopping mechanism. Another would be the steering system. So all these systems can be again broken down into their sub elements. They can have sub problems within them and those also need to be solved to solve the overall larger problem of the vehicle. So this functional decomposition is started in the concept phase and then it is done at a very detailed level in the detailed design phase.